Welcome back to Studio Chatter. I think it's pretty safe to say that you have a box of old videotapes and photos that are just getting older. Let's fix that problem. Welcome Kevin Euler from Euler Media, Media Conversion. Conversion. Okay. <laughs> to the table Thank with you. your wife. With my wife. Right. How awesome is this? This is so great, guys. We'll Should we just, just found <laughs> some little honk on the side of the road and, and brought him along? No, seriously, thank you for having me tonight. Yeah. I'm excited. Well, to be I here. used your services. I brought a box of little video the, tapes yeah, from like my the, cassette, yeah. my home movie yep. cassette player. So it wasn't the VHS, just the small ones. Gave Kevin a box, and I said, I, I don't even know what's on him. And well, I swear you had him done within a week and a half. I don't know if that's your normal turnaround time. It's and now pretty... we have blackmail on Stacy. <laughs> yes, you do. I'm sure. <laughs> Everything whoopsie. No. Bad haircut. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm able to, at least at this point, I'm able to turn around pretty quick. A yeah. week, two weeks at the most, I think. Um, there's Depending one, on how many. There's one that I'm working on now that's taken a little bit longer because of the amount of tapes that they have plus what they're asking me to do. Okay. They, they want every one of their tapes also copy to DVD, which yeah, I typically don't do, and that takes okay, time. Okay, I was going to ask right. that because years ago, I put all my little ones on DVDs. Yep. I took it to a place that did that, but now I don't want them on DVDs. Yeah. I want it like, what do you do, a thumb yeah, drive? That's, or? that's a great thing to point out because as technology changes, we need to we need to also make sure that we're we're changing with that meaning if you had yours done on DVD you can't buy a computer anymore that has a DVD no, player on it. No, I had to buy a separate one for my yeah. Mac to run and, those. And so what I do is somebody will bring in their tapes like Stacy did and I will digitize everything and I'll put it on a thumb drive and give you that thumb drive and encourage you currently to put it all in the cloud because that's where we're at with with technology. Mm -hmm. Once it's in the cloud, it's pretty much it's secure and safe, whether it be a Google Google Drive or an Apple iCloud or, or whatever it is that mm -hmm. you use. But once you've got it in the cloud, it's pretty good. But, but again, who knows what 10 years from now will be. Right. And it could change again. So I would just encourage you to be aware of, of technology as it changes. If you've got old DVDs now, bring those in, get those digitized and, and put on a thumb drive and, and up to and the tell, cloud. And tell everybody why it's important to get those, go and dig through and pull out the old tapes and get them digitized. So one, one main reason is because tape specifically does not stay good forever. Uh, it deteriorates about 20% after 15 to 20 years. And so as people are bringing me their old VHS tapes oh. that they want converted from the early 90s, the 80s, the older, the further back you go, the the poorer the quality is, oh, and there's not a lot that you can do to fix and restore those. There are some things that you can do as far as the audio to get rid of clicks and different things um, with audio, but as far as the quality, once it's deteriorated, there's really not anything you can do. Okay. So that's why it's important to do it as quickly as you can because the longer you wait, uh, the the poorer the quality, plus you take the risk of having something happen to the tapes. Right, Either right. your house floods or burn, you know, a fire, hopefully. Not that never happens, those, right? But, but you don't know. You never well, know. and even <laughs> for us, we weren't watching them. We weren't seeing and viewing those images and those memories because we couldn't find our camcorder that yes. then could hook up yeah, to a yes. TV that could even play that. Yeah. And that's that's and that really was so tricky. That's really what got me into the, the business is I've done this for years with my own family, with our videos, Angela and I's. Mm -hmm where I would, I would take them, I would convert them. I took my parents' home videos when I was a kid, converted them and put them, made them in a format that I can now share with all of my siblings. So cool. So I don't have to burn a DVD for each of them. I've got them in the cloud. I've got a server and a service that I use that they can all log into accounts that they have and watch home videos it's of all of like us a, kids. like Netflix. You yeah. just, yeah. from your TV, you just log on and you can just view them. So te so yeah, nice. technology yeah, now, yeah. so it makes it so easy to share our, share our media with others. Mm -hmm. And that's the last thing you want to do is go and get them put on DVD or whatever it is, spend that money mm -hmm. and never watch them. How many times do we, do, let me ask you Angie, <laughs> when you want to record your kids or your grandkids, what do you use? Usually now? my phone now. Your phone, yep. right? 
So does Angela, so do I. Mm -hmm. The problem is now, when do our kids or our grandkids ever watch the videos that we're recording yes, with totally our devices? I feel like I have like 80,000 pictures yes. I noticed in the cloud on my phone yeah. and I was like, what am I doing with this? Yeah, so that's another thing that I do. We, we had a family trip, a family vacation a year ago. Angela's taking video with her phone, I'm taking video with mine. We have another camera that we're taking video on. I take all those videos of this family vacation that we went on and I combine them in order of the beginning of the trip to the end of the trip. So I have three different sources combined into now a single family video of that vacation to where our kids can now go and watch, watch. all of that. And, yeah. and I love it. And so they do you love it. take more video than photos? Because I'm a big photographer on vacations and if I'm with friends or extended family or whatever, we're all sharing the album so everyone's things are dropping in. But I find like, the video snippets are usually super small, so if I went on a vacation and had you make a video, it could be two minutes. Yeah, I was surprised. But so tons of pictures, like 800 photos. I was surprised, so this trip that I'm talking about, we were gone for, I think it was nine days, we went to Mexico, and we have, yes, tons of photos, but when I combined the total amount of video footage oh, okay. into a single video file, it was two and a half hours long. You're not serious. <laughs> I'm serious. Yes. But see, lately I've been videoing and then I'll just click, click, click some pictures and they may not be as like crystal clear, but as you're videoing on your phone, you can do still shots too. I figured that out, but mm -hmm. my yeah. daughter also showed me how you can be in the video, yes. stop it, uh -huh. and then take it yes. from there too. Yep. Yeah. So I video more now than I used to just because I okay. realize so that. So Kevin, and, and we can give you our, our things <laughs> off of our phone videos and yeah, then you can so come back. That's an option so as well, yes. Do we yes. organize Email those well. or do we just t give our phone so or how do we do question. that? Good question, good yeah. question. So if somebody wants to have this done, they can go to my website, EulerMediaConversion.com and there's a form that they can fill out there to set up an appointment. I'll reach out to them and say, okay, what's a good time for you? Right now I'm working out of my home. Uh, so everything I do is just at home. We'll schedule an appointment. They bring a box of all but yeah, of the whatever they have. Yeah, the reason why they schedule an appointment is because you have two other jobs, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, but so you sure. why. But yeah. he gets back to them pretty fast. Yeah. So they'll we set up a time. They bring it over to the house. Their box of media. Bring it in. We take pictures to make sure we know exactly what it is. They dropped off, yep. and then then start working on it and then it's like like you say it's about a week or two turn around to get everything back to them so do you need our phones or can we airdrop them to you or how do you do that if we just have a or in the cloud i guess yeah no obviously you don't want to leave your phone right. for a week nobody <laughs> can do that right right <laughs> and so usually if it's if it's something like that where they want media off of their phone if they've already uploaded it to the cloud the best thing is to create a shared album Okay. And then share it that way, and then I've oh, got access to the super right? easy. Yep. Create a shared album, share it with me. I can then download the video files oh that you want gosh. converted and combine them. And then like take our duplicates <laughs> and stuff like that I've and got, get rid of it. Yep, yeah. I've got a software, piece of software that will go through <laughs> and find all of the duplicates, photos, or even if they're pretty similar. Uh -huh. Like how many times you have somebody take a family photo, you're all standing <laughs> oh, in front of the beach right? and you say, hey, take a them. picture for us, and you've now got 20 of so, the same yes. photo. And I hate right. that. Because did you, when you said you had from Mexico two and a half hours worth, was that just a video or was that your photos and video? That was just our, that just was just video. video. Yes. Just video. But if we wanted to, could we, do you do the part of like, let's say there's 800 photos plus, you know, 10 minutes of video. Could you put the photos in with it? You could do that if okay. that's what Kind of like wanted. a wedding video yeah. type yeah. Yeah. deal. Yeah. Okay. Music to it. Yeah, you could. yeah. Now, one thing I want people to know is Mother's Day is coming up. Mm. Mm. And there is no better gift. I agree. Than really? Than being able to watch those things. I can't tell you how many customers come in and they are so excited. It was almost, a, there was a couple that came in, they're almost fighting. Like, she's like, I want to watch when we get home. He's like, well, we're going to have to wait because I got this and this to do. And she's just so excited. Yeah. And, but it, and, and they just, it is, it is life changing. So you really. asked about videos and pictures. If you, get your kids together or your grandkids together. You want to look through photo albums mm -hmm. or would you rather watch actual video? Yeah. Oh yeah, and just listen, throw it on the TV and just voices. let it go. Yeah, and so you, you want video. So I would definitely encourage you okay. to continue taking more video. That's a good, good move because since January when you gave me my little USB thing, mm -hmm. what's it called? Just drive. thumb drive. drive. Yeah. That's what we do on Sunday nights. The family all comes over for dinner and then we put that on and, and it's just been lo loads of fun. 
Kevin, yeah. our time's up. Oh, darn it. Thank okay. you. This is inspiring, though. Yeah. I love the Mother's Day idea. Yes. yes. That's a great idea. Do that's it. That's fun. Dig them out. You have, to, you have to get them converted anyways. Just do it now. Okay, so they can yeah. just go to your website and find out more. Yeah. Okay. Yep, Perfect. Sure. Thank awesome. you. Thanks, Thank Kevin. you. Thank you. Coming up next is your chance to get some free legal advice. Stay with us.